What's going on, Bird Gang? Eagles Nation, Fly Eagles Fly on the road to victory. It is your boy D Biggie 86 coming at you with another flipping video. I'm just gonna get right to it. Cravon LeBlanc is back in the building. He is back in the Midnight Green. Uh, a lot of Eagles fans kind of overreacted uh, when he got released, me included. We kind of really didn't know why he was released. Uh, we had we just literally not even 24 hours ago got rid of Sidney Jones and Rasul Douglas, and then we get rid of Craven LeBlanc. So that kind of worried me that we would go into the season with only four DBs until I did my research um, and I found out that Craven LeBlanc was released so we can make room for um, the running back that uh, we acquired from the Detroit Lions. So Craven LeBlanc was released so we can make room for him and then we got him back. So basically Craven LeBlanc spent the night at a friend's house and is now back, basically. Um, so great news, glad to, glad to have him back. Uh, I was kind of worried, like I said, that we would only go into the season with four DBs, but now that he's back, that's good news. Um, that kind of um, reassures me a little bit. Um, more big news, Jason Peters will be back at left tackle, and y'all don't understand how um, relieved I am that he is back at his original spot, especially um, week one, you know, with us going against the Washington No Name, the Washington No Names, uh, you know, you got Ryan Kerrigan on one side and you got Chase Young on the other side, and having Mulatto or Matt Pryor at that left tackle left tackle position wasn't wasn't going to be a good deal. You know, that's Carson Wentz's blind side, and we need his blind side protected more. Really, to be honest, we need it. His blind side needs to be well protected, and the bodyguard Jason Peters is uh, the right right fit for that. So uh, I'm glad he came to his senses and um, decided to go back to left tackle because that's where he belongs. He's not a right guard; he's a left tackle. Um, it's good for him. It was actually good for him to um, get that exposure, get that experience at um, at the guard. So just in case we do need somebody for that um, position, you know, Jason Peters, he can do it. So, I mean, we really don't know how, how long, how much longer Jason Peters is going to hold up, but uh, we'd rather have him at his uh, rifle spot um, than go into another position and, you know, getting hurt. I mean, I'm sure he's going to miss a couple games here and there um, this season, but it's, it's just refreshing to have him back there at his spot. So, <sighs> Good news, good news today. Um, these Washington No Name fans, man, they they really are confident right now. They they are really confident. They really think they're going to beat the Philadelphia Eagles um, on Sunday. Uh, uh, you know, at the first game of the season, they think so. Cowboy fans think so. Um, everybody thinks the Red, the Eagles are going to lose. And you know what? I love it. I love it. Keep doubting us. Keep hating on the Eagles. You know, we got to let them haters be our motivators, and that's what happens. You know, everyone talks about the Cowboys, how they have this stacked roster, and they're going to do this and do this and do that. And, uh, you know, they said that last year, and with a full, healthy roster, the Cowboys didn't do anything. They didn't do anything at all. They didn't make the playoffs. They didn't win the East, which they should have. With a healthy, full roster, they should have won the East and been in, play in the playoffs. So, um I'm just gonna. I'm not. I'm not gonna talk any trash. I'm gonna keep my mouth shut. I'm just gonna let the Eagles handle their business. Um, a lot of Redskins. Or Redskins. I got a, a lot of no name. Um, a lot of Washington no name fans are pretty. Uh, are really really confident. So um, yeah, I'm just gonna keep my mouth shut and uh, you know let the Eagles be the Eagles. So I'm excited, man. Football is eight six days away. Six days. Yeah, six days away. Uh, I, I cannot wait. I've been waiting on football for the longest time. Uh, it's going to be great. It's going to be great. It's going to be great. So, yeah, that's it, y'all. That's all I really wanted to say, man. Uh, welcome back, Craven LeBlanc. No surprise there. Um, and Jason Peters, um, back at his original spot. Lord, I'm, I can't drive right now. Um, so, yeah, uh, that's it, y'all. That's all I wanted to say. Uh, make sure y'all go ahead and like this video. Go ahead and comment on it. Tell me what you think. Uh, about these Washington no names being so confident that they think they're gonna win this game on Sunday, they think they're gonna go 12 and 4, 11 and 5, whatever it is. 
So tell me what you think in the comments. Um, go ahead and uh, and go ahead and sub me up. And after you sub me up, go ahead and hit that bell so you get every notification of whenever I upload a video. But that's it for me, y'all. Fly Eagles fly. Blue green, we're gonna lose. And y'all know what to do. Always make somebody smile. I'm out of here.